Hi everyone, welcome back to another episode of Tastefully Balanced. I'm Miriam, and for today's episode, I thought I would share with you another easy recipe that you can make with your kids. These are going to be PB&J cookies. Very limited ingredients and perfect for kids because who doesn't like a good old classic PB&J sandwich? So if you guys love easy recipes, please subscribe and keep watching. All right, welcome back. So the first thing you wanna do is preheat your oven to 350 degrees. And then you just wanna take whatever peanut butter you use, in my case, I am using the Costco one that has a bunch of seeds and nuts in it. Now, this one has a different texture than other peanut butters, so I wouldn't actually recommend this exact one. It's better to go with a crunchy or creamy, just plain peanut butter instead of getting a mixture like this. That being said, all you do is just put it in a bowl and you add some sugar. In my case, I added a cup of monk fruit sweetener. You can use regular sugar because then I think the shape will hold a little bit better, but it was fine with monk fruit as well. And then I am going to be using a flaxseed egg, which is just one tablespoon of flaxseed, ground flaxseed, mixed with three tablespoons of water. But if you have an egg, go ahead and use an egg. And then you just add a little bit of vanilla extract. Now mix this all together and then form it into little balls, about one tablespoon size. Make them a tiny bit bigger if you want, but that's really it. All you do is just roll them up, flatten them down, create a little hole in the middle. I just used a teaspoon to create a little hole in the middle of each of the cookies. And that is where you're going to put a little bit of jelly. I use Use a reduced sugar jelly from Trader Joe's, but feel free to use whatever type of jelly you have. And it's as simple as that. Your cookies are now formed and they just need to be baked. So I baked mine for about 10 minutes and let them cool about five minutes after that. But then you are ready, that is it. These are such easy, easy cookies. And honestly, every bite, tastes like a PB&J sandwich, except for the bread. So the better part of the sandwich, in my opinion. So super easy and the kids are absolutely gonna love it, I can guarantee. So mine came out a little bit flatter because I used the different type of peanut butter, but I've made these with regular peanut butter. And actually in the description box, I'm going to link my old blog where I first made these. And you can have a kick at looking at my old blog too, but I will share my recipe back then. I've just modified it a little bit now with my own preferences. So that is it, super easy, super quick cookie recipe. All right, there you guys go. That is my super easy peanut butter and jelly cookies that is perfect to make with kids because very limited ingredients and really easy to make. So if you guys love simple recipes like this, please, please comment, like, share, and subscribe. And as always, live life tastefully balanced.